The Bonneville Youth Development Council is educating parents on the warning signs of drug use in our young people. Local News Ace Tyler Berg was at tonight's presentation. Tyler, what did you learn? Well, according to a study from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, deaths from drug overdose and abuse now exceed deaths from car accidents in the U.S. So the BYDC is trying to get ahead of the problem by telling parents what to keep an eye on. We try really hard to help parents connect those dots a, a lot sooner. Coordinator Alicia Passy is warning parents for behaviors that might point to drug use. Grades suddenly change, loss of old friends and gaining of new friends, um, behavior changes sometimes if they're really irritable. Passy says they focus on gateway drugs. We talk a lot about alcohol and underage drinking, um, marijuana use, underage, and also prescription drug abuse. She says there are visible warnings. Signs that point to marijuana use. Teens think that if you blow your marijuana smoke through the dryer sheets, that you don't get that smell in your house. Music and clothing can also be an indicator. Actually, these colors we talk a lot about um, are very um, linked to marijuana use. But some are harder to see than others. Take this Dr. Pepper can. Normal, right? Well, unscrew the top and you have a container to hide drugs. The Bonneville Youth Development Council is made up of teens that even help point out new trends. They don't want substance abuse in their community. They see what that does to their friends and um, relatives, and they just want a safe community to grow up in. And for parents, even if it's not your kid doing drugs, Passy says these presentations are still valuable. You know, it may not be their kid, but it may be somebody their kids know. And nine times out of ten, it probably is somebody that they know. And guys, the Partnership for Drug-Free Kids says 90% of addiction starts in the teen years. Live in the studio, I'm Tyler Berg. All right, thank you, Tyler. And you can find information on how to schedule one of those presentations on our website at localnews8.com. They really are excellent and effective. Well, let's check in now with Michael Coates. He's got our...